In this video, I'm going to show you how to mass delete tweets. And since X only allows you to delete one post at a time, you're going to need a third party software to do this. So I'm going to show you two options. The first one is a free option with limited capabilities. And then the second one is a paid option, but it has a lot more features. The free option is a Chrome extension called delete tweets. So in order to install it, go to the Chrome web store, search for delete tweets, download the extension and install it. And then in order for it to work, you just have to go to X, click on your extensions, pull up delete tweets. And then there's a number of criteria you could use. So for example, if you wanted to delete certain posts just within a certain range, you could do that. Or if you just wanna delete everything, then you can do that too. And then once you've got the criteria set up as you want to, you just click start and it will get to work. So if you're just looking for a simple and easy method to wipe your account, this is probably the easiest way to do that. But if you're looking for some more robust features, then now let's talk about the paid option. And this is a tool called Tweet Deleter. This tool also has the ability to filter by specific criteria. So you could filter by posts, reposts, likes, et cetera. But then you can also filter by media type. So if you wanted to delete every post you've made with a picture, then you could do that. You've also got the option to delete all of your posts, but it's gonna look a little different inside Tweet Deleter because you need an archive of your data. So in order to get this, you're gonna to go to X, click on settings and privacy, and then download an archive of your data. It usually takes about 24 hours to download, and then you'll get a notification when it's done. And all you'll do is go into Tweet Deleter, click on upload archive, and then drag your file in there. And then to delete all of your tweets from Tweet Deleter, then you'll just click delete all, and then it will take care of that for you. Then one of the last features you've got in there is the auto deleter. And what this will do is it allows you to delete content from your profile based on specific criteria on a time interval that you specify. For example, you could tell it to delete your content once a post reaches a certain age or once you got a certain tweet count on your profile. And you may be wondering why this would be necessary, but if you're not familiar with X, there's something called TweepCred that is built into the algorithm and it limits your reach based on what you post and who you interact with. And I'm not gonna get into everything about TweepCred in this video, but the short of it is that in certain niches, it's easy for problems to arise because of who you're interacting with and the type of content that you're posting. So I know of some accounts that set up this auto delete feature to automatically delete their content once it's older than six months to prevent issues with reach in the future. So make sure to check out Tweet Deleter. And if you wanna learn more about TweetCred, click the video on screen for a full breakdown of how it works and how you can protect your account from shadow bans.